useless body. Move! No, I still have things to do. Tage? Oh, sorry. I thought you were someone else. You're a heretic, right? Huh? I'm sorry, but according to church law, all heretics must be killed. Wh what I don't even know who you are. And wh where's your proof that I'm even a heretic? I'm a human. Why do you have silver hair? Why do you hide your neck behind that scarf? Th that's... Look, I don't know why you've come here. But now that I've seen you, I can't let you leave. The Church of Aldia has strict policies on dealing with heretics. That's it! I'm tired of your narrow-minded church! I'm tired of the Majin telling me I have cursed blood! <sighs> what do I do? Do I fight her? Don't worry, it'll all be over real quick. If you're going to attack me, don't expect me to go down quietly! It's been a while, Ashley. Tage! Did you just say, Tage? What are you doing here, Ashley? Are you really Tage? The boy's my servant. I own him. You weren't trying to damage my property, were you? There's heretics with you? You've got to be kidding, right? Is there a problem with my choice of companions? Tage, you know he's a heretic, right? His kind will bring misfortune to our world. He needs to be executed. You don't have the right to judge this child. I'm a priest, a protector of the faith. I swore an oath to do the goddess's will. The church's teachings seem to have taken over your sense of reason since the last time I saw you. Redica is a heretic, but he's also a human. He's no human. His blood is impure. Prove it, Ashley. Show me he's not a human. You don't mean... There's nothing to be gained from continuing this argument. So it's time for us to... fight? You have a better solution? It's only natural. The only 
only way to get any sense into that head of yours is through force. Do you understand now, Ashley? I guess you won't see the error of your ways until it's too late. I lost, so I'll back down. But that child will only bring sin and misfortune. Let me worry about him. Then I don't have anything left to say. Will you keep moving onward? We can't turn back until I have finished my journey. You should know, I met Princess Lenarche in Bessic. Or rather, she was Princess Lenarche. What do you mean she was Lenarche? You wouldn't understand. Alright, well, I'll keep that in mind. Take care, Tage. You too. I guess some things don't change. Tage. I... I don't care if you're a human or a heretic. I am a heretic. Doomed to live alone. Shunned from the world. Cursed. Impure. Redica, I don't have time for your complaints. But heretics bring destruction. That's what everyone says. I don't think you'd be able to cause much destruction. I'm not worried about your blood. Tage. Don't ask me any questions right now. As long as the oath of obedience is on you, you're still my servant. Don't forget. All right. Why are you searching for the eternal poison? You knew, huh? You don't disguise your motives well. A Majin killed my mother. In the Church of Stag, we believe the eternal poison can grant immense power. And I want that power to avenge my mother. If I can find it, nothing else matters. And where is this Majin you want to kill? Somewhere in Bessic. Somewhere that's especially dark and unholy. Somewhere where only the most evil Majin live. But... But... I don't have much longer. There's still a chance we'll find the Majin you're after. But this place... I know, I know. I may never find him. Let's keep looking for the eternal poison. I'm glad you're thinking straight. Let's move out. I don't have long. I'll be dead soon. But I have to keep going. <laughs>